just an incredible, incredible, incredible hurricane. Uh, it has dropped. It has dropped 50 millibars in 10 hours. Um, I apologize. This is just horrific. Hurricane Milton is now a Category 5 storm after quickly gaining strength in the Gulf of Mexico. It continues to defy all expectations and intensify at a rate faster than anybody expected. It increased 100 miles per hour in 24 hours. That's only happened once before in our recorded history. This is remarkable because it wasn't more, just a little more than 24 hours ago that this was a tropical storm. This is the oddest weather predicament that there has ever been. So I can't believe that there's already another one. And if you look at the rapid intensification, I don't believe in my time, I, I certainly haven't seen this much. Overnight it was a Cat 1, now it's a Cat 5, and really anything above 156 miles an hour is classified as a Category 5, and it's now up to 180 miles an hour. In the Gulf of Mexico, it is the strongest that we've ever seen when this late in the season, too. Amazing. And is expected to make landfall on Wednesday. That's less than two weeks since Hurricane Helene slammed into Florida's Big Bend area, killing 227 people across six states. But look at this. It's just been hard to find words to describe the eye, the symmetry. Like it is just the rapid intensification this morning has been mind blowing. I mean, really staggering numbers here. And you're we approaching. Really hope it weekends. Yeah, I mean, you're, you're approaching 200 miles an hour. That that is really, really incredible. And it could hit some of the same areas of Florida that were just pummeled by Hurricane Helene less than two weeks ago. And unbelievable that this would be happening in such fast sequence. The force storm is now churning in the Atlantic Ocean. Forecasters say waves from Hurricane Kirk could cause life-threatening surf and rip current conditions this weekend along the U.S. East Coast, Bermuda, the Greater Antilles, and Bahamas. For the first time on record, three hurricanes are active in the Atlantic Basin in the month of October. Thanks to the Cooperative Institute for Research in the Atmosphere, here you can see these images, the trio Hurricane Milton, Hurricane Kirk, and Hurricane Leslie all developing. Milton became a Category 1 hurricane in the Gulf Coast yesterday. And of course, right now, Monday evening, it is the strongest hurricane on record in the Gulf of Mexico during the month of October. Roughly 2.1 million customers are without power across the region. New drone video shows just how bad the situation is in Asheville. The city's now isolated after roads leading there flooded and cell towers were knocked down. One emergency official calls it biblical devastation. Death toll continues to climb from Hurricane Helene, now one of the deadliest hurricanes on record. Hello, I'm Steve Eager. More than 120 people have died since Helene made landfall late Thursday night.